WTFNN. Headline news update. Hi everyone, Basil Chapman here on this 30th day of March. Tomorrow wraps up that monthly candle you can see on the right. You can see where that closes. Most importantly, on Friday we had a fabulous rally, and then just in that last half hour, last hour, boom, slide to the downside, sharp reversal, and that continued with a gap down last night. 600 points in the futures in the Dow, 60 something points in the S&P. Well, <clears throat> we're now down. We're up. 421 points in the Dow at 22,055 right now. The S&P is also up quite sharply. The uh, S&P is up 55 points at 2596. Um, very nice move. Both of them need to make a leg B in the Chapman Wave methodology by going above Thursday's high. In the S&P's case, is 2637.01 and it's 2595 right now. The QQQ had a slightly better chart formation. It needs to get above 192.72 to start a leg B. That's, that'll be very good in the Chapman Wave methodology. We're up five at 190.21. Key support in, in all the cases here are today's low initially and then Friday's low, of course. Uh, in the IWM, which is the Russell 2000, we're looking at uh, up 143 at 113.99. Actually, a little bit sli slightly better chart formation but it needs to get above the 14 period moving average. It needs to really get above the uh, Thursday, yep, the Thursday high of 117.60. It's 113.94 right now. And if you're looking at gold, gold at this point is down 12 at 1641. Remember, uh, a high level consolidation taking place. I still think that gold is a place that, that folks will jump to on any real nervousness. Their silver is actually acting, um, is down. Uh, 0.29 at 1423. It, it has a slightly better uh, chart formation just uh, intraday, but not the, the weekly and monthly are not very good. And if you look at the dollar, the dollar is trying to rally. It had quite a sharp decline from the 102.99 high of about a week and a half ago. Uh, it's trading right now at 99.09, up 75 cents. It needs to start trading above 1990. It needs to get to the 100 level and fairly soon if it's going to retrace. I'll be doing a lot more in the coming hour. We're going to talk about what, what I'm looking at, the bigger picture, why we're looking at it. I'll go through a couple of things like this little e-mini chart here that just gave a very short-term sell signal on the, on the two-minute, not yet the 10-minute. I'll be talking what, much more about the market overall. Be back in a moment. Basil Chapman, Tiger Technicians Hour coming right up. Hope to see you there. Otherwise, have a great day. See you tomorrow.